Hello, sorry the lighting is poor right now. Uh, once we get moved, things will be better. This is uh, some jewelry that I purchased from a YouTube channel. Cindy Loves Jewelry. Here's her card. Right there, Cindy Loves Jewelry. And, um, yeah, you can find her online by just typing in Cindy Loves Jewelry. But she had a live auction. Oh, of course, we had a thank you sticker. She had a live auction of some jewelry. And I must say, I got a little bit carried away. <laughs> this is why I, uh, I usually don't go to auctions because I get swept up in the excitement of the bidding factor and stuff. So, yeah, I got a little bit swept up in the excitement and bid on uh, more items than I probably normally would have and definitely bid more than I normally <laughs> would have. And I really, I don't even remember what it was I bid on, to be honest with you. <laughs> Oh my goodness gracious, so let's pull some of this stuff out so we can look at what we got going on here. I also won a pair of earrings as a giveaway item. So where are those earrings? Here they are right here. Here's the pair of earrings that I won, which are really pretty. I don't know if you're seeing them too well. Sorry for the lighting. Uh, let me see if I can do something about that. I'm going to bring you over here. Let's see. Have it to where you're not backlit. More light. All right. There we go. That's better. All right. So here are the earrings. That one is a giveaway. Very pretty. I actually will be wearing these. They're not going to be resold. Um, there is a cross with a faith fish. I don't know if you're seeing that. It's a very pretty piece. This one um, I will sell because that's not something I would wear. Now this piece right here, I don't really want to take it out of plastic, but I do want you to see it. There we go. Yeah, this piece right here, yeah, screw it. Let's take it out so you can really see it. I am going to be wearing this one because I really like it. I just think that it's so pretty. Very, very pretty. It pops, pops, pop, pops. Nice little piece for sure. Okay. And this is a pendant on a chain. Let me take it out so you can actually see it. I do like that she kept everything um, that was separate previously. Kept it separate so it wouldn't get all tangled up. Because you know how jewelry can be. But yeah, look at that. Isn't that pretty? thought that was a nice piece. And I almost wish that this stone can be... Like switched out with other ones, like you could snap other ones in. That's not the case, but I'm thinking that I could easily bend these back and then pop that stone out because that's a very standard size. And um, then I could do some kind of maybe Velcro on the back and on the other side. And if I can find a few stones, different colors, then I could have a whole set that I could switch it out with. But even if not, I like it, you know, I think it's pretty with the black, but I'm just saying, I bet I could uh, work with this and turn it into even better, even more, even more. Yes, I think I can. All right, so. Next up, this one I love because I have found out that I am Irish. I am very Irish, actually. Um, so, yeah. 
I thought a little sparkly clover would be a nice way to celebrate my Irish heritage. Yeah. All right. Keep on, keep it on. Now this, I don't know what's in this and she didn't show. So this is kind of like a mystery bag. Um, same thing within here. <laughs> it's like mystery, which I love a good mystery. So let's get in here and see what the mystery is. Let's solve that mystery, shall we? Okay, we're starting off with some dangle earrings. These are very pretty, and they, it looks like they're on a hook loop. I will keep these and wear these because I do like them. <laughs> Ooh, just looks like some shell, pieces of shell maybe. Just little dangle earrings, very pretty, very subtle. I like them. I would probably wear these and keep these as well. Ooh, some chunky hoops. Yep. <laughs> I would wear these. I'm going to probably wear most of this damn jewelry. I'm not going to get rid of anything. <laughs> oh, all right. I got to sit down. Hold on a second. Okay, this is better. Sorry, I had to sit down. I was not feeling good bending over the way. <laughs> the position I was in it was not working for me. Now, these are interesting. These are some little baby blue dangle earrings. Very tiny, very delicate. Very much like me. <laughs> you know, I don't know if you're seeing it. I hope you're seeing it. Very pretty. Yeah, those are very, very pretty. I like those. I, again, these are ones I would wear, so I'll be keeping them. We're going to just dump this whole thing out for now and make it easier. It looks like some of the stuff may be slightly tangled, so we're going to gently try and separate everything out. Okay, oh, this is an interesting earring. And it looks like, yep, here's his little buddy. It's a little bit tangled here at the bottom, but should be pretty easy to sort out with a little bit of time and patience. And maybe a magnifying glass because I can't see so good. But yeah, it's a pretty earring. And it looks like, yeah, it's black beads. Very pretty. Once I get this thing untangled, then um, it is one that I would wear. For sure, for sure. And I think that uh, untangling it is not going to be that difficult. It's just going to take a little bit of time. I got all the time in the world. Go ahead and pop those back in there. Okay, it looks like we have a bracelet here. Yeah, Lucy, a bracelet. It's a stretch bracelet. Oh, I wish I could. Let me see if I can get a better position with the camera so I can see what y'all are seeing. What were you height? There we go. Less glare for you. All right. Okay, that's better. Now I can actually see what you're seeing. Yeah, this is very pretty. Not missing any stones. Nope, it's completely intact. Not too tight. Yeah, this might be one that I might keep. I think it's very pretty. It's comfortable. So yeah, definitely a possibility of a keeper. I don't like it. Alright. So we'll put that back in the bag. Next up. This is sitting here all by itself. Just a little drop down faux pearl. It's cute. All 
I actually like the simplicity of it, so that is one I would probably wear. I might change the chain on that just because that's probably a little short for my own taste. Now this is just a gold decorative chain with little, little hearts. Not very long, but it's cute. Um, I would think that this would be a good piece for layering. No, I don't know if I'd keep this one or not. It would just depend if I had something I could layer it with that, would I, that I would like. Now this is just a square box charm. Let's see if I can get it to focus on this. There we go. It's cute. It is cute. It's interesting. Alright, what else we got here? Looks like we have... Okay, this is similar to the heart one, except for this is not hearts. It's just... It's just little round discs. I'm really sorry about the lighting. I know that the lighting is horrible. But yeah, this isn't bad. Um, again, I would see this as a good one to use as a layering piece. Alright, here is another one. This one has, it looks like a red, black, and off-white ecru heart. Pretty cute. Silver chain. And with the right outfit, I think this could be cute. Like if you have something that just has, you know, you have red and you just want a little pop of red around your neck. There you go. This probably you could even wear this with the navy because that black is so small that it could pass for navy easily. And then it gives it more of a nautical feel. Alright, I'm not sure what's going on here, so let's, let's see what's happening. Okay, it looks like this... Okay, we have a little bracelet here with a cute little heart. Oh, okay. Heart has some bling on it. A little sparkle, sparkle. Cute. Small bracelet. Um... Would probably fit me. I don't know if I'd wear it or not, but it is cute. I'm just not much into bracelets, and um, when I do wear bracelets, I don't like them to do a lot of movement on my wrist because I move around. My I move my hands a lot when I talk. So, okay, so this is a very interesting piece. It's got a lot going on here. It's got dangles, it's got balls, it's got squares, it's got fake stones, it's it's just it's got a lot going on here. It's got some sparklies. This is a very interesting piece. Here's the clasp. Lobster claw lobster claw clasp right there. I don't know, I can see that this could be fun. Um you get like if you have an outfit, maybe it has this color in it, or maybe this color. This could be an interesting piece to have it pop. Um, as kind of loud as this is, I don't know. I just, I don't know. I would shorten it up, of course. But, I don't know. I might try to wear this with something. We'll see. Alrighty. That is it for that little bag of goodies. Let's see what's going on in here. If there is a piece that you saw that you thought was exceptionally pretty or your style, let me know in the comment section which one spoke to you. Okay, all right, here we go. Starting off interesting. Whoa, hello, sorry about that flag. Man, it looks like all the stones 
All the stones seem to be in this. It is intact. It, it's a little American flag pen. I actually think this is really cute and it would look really cute to wear like on 4th of July or maybe on inauguration day or something. Just as a little pop of some patriotism. But yeah, I really actually like this a lot better than most of the American flag pins that I've seen. It's cute. So that's a nice item. I will keep that because I will wear that. Okay, we've got stuff just kind of falling out. Let's see if we can dump a few things. All right, here's a matching set. All the stones seem to be there. Now, I don't have a lot of jewelry that is yellow. So, I actually find these to be really interesting and I like them. I like the color yellow that they are. They kind of have that iridescence quality. So yeah, I'll be keeping these and wearing these. I'm probably not going to get rid of hardly any of this jewelry. <laughs> oh my god, a jewelry hoarder. Okay. Ooh, we have a ring. Nice. I was kind of hoping there would be a ring somewhere hidden in this. If I could see, I could tell. If it's focused or not. It doesn't look like it is. Sorry about that. There we go. It's just a pretty basic... Simplistic ring. I don't know if this is a real stone. It's probably a um, just a fake stone, but it is pretty. Uh, I don't know if this is one I'll keep, just because this is so close to my skin tone. Um, but I don't know with rings. Like if they're gonna have any kind of color to them, I really like it to be a pop of color and not my skin tone. So this may be a ring that I um, rehome, if you will. If I can get it off my chunky finger. All right, what else we got going on here? Okay, okay. So these actually are clip-on earrings, which I will probably um, change out the hardware and make these to where they're hoop, or you not hoops, um, Oh, this would look really cute on hoops, though. I don't know. We'll have to play with it. But I probably am going to deconstruct these ones. They're very pretty, though. And that's why I want to deconstruct them. I think I could turn them into something that I would enjoy more. But yeah, those would be... Ooh, there's a little hole in that bag. Oh, well, I guess I can show you a little bit better now, can't I? Real pretty. Real pretty. Real, real, real pretty. Okay, so these are some clip-ons. Okay, let me see how they're attached here. Okay. Okay. Well, because I'm not much of a clip-ons earring person myself, so, with clip-ons, I like to see, can they be um, altered and turned into earrings that actually are for pierced ears. And I actually, I think that I could alter these. I think I could pull off this hardware here at the back and um, put a mount right there. Yeah, I think I could. These are pretty, though. They have the stones in them. They have some faux sparklies and some faux pearl pearls. They're pretty. I could see these looking really nice with maybe like a really dressy outfit. So, yeah, this might be one that I might wind up, um, you know, making some alterations too. We'll see. And any that I do alterations to, I will do that over on my art channel, which is always linked in the description below every video I post. Okay, let's see what's going on in this little bag. 
Okay, so we've got a couple pierced earrings. Very pretty. Ooh, I like those. I like those a lot. Yeah, these would be ones I would keep and wear because those are pretty. Oh my goodness. Those are so pretty, pretty, pretty. I wish that they were dangle earrings, like had a attach them here at the top. But pierced is uh, just regular pierced ones is fine as well. Yeah, I'd wear these. They are very pretty. Pop a red in the outfit and bam! You're ready to go to town, sister. Okay, we have a pretty heavy um, anal bead necklace. Pardon me if that's uh, incorrect, but that's what this looks like to me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness, uh, good morning. This is not for people to watch while they're at work. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, it's a very interesting necklace. Um, it is not one that I would see myself wearing, really. Um, unless I was going for kind of um, an anal bead look. But it's not usually what I look for in a my look. So yeah, um, this would probably be one that I would find a new home for. <laughs> I'm so disturbed. Okay, what we got here? We have a very, very, very thin weight, very thin metal, um, women, woman in a hat pin. It's actually a pretty cute pin. Very lightweight. I like that it is light. Wouldn't, uh, you know, weigh anything down, but on the outside of like a winter coat, this could look really cute. It's kind of mysterious. I like it. I don't know. I don't know. I'll keep it for a little while if I find something that I can wear it with and make, you know, I'll keep it for a little while. But it may be one that in the long run winds up re getting a rehomed. All right, what else we got here? Feel some chains. Keep pulling the chains and see what we got going on here. Oh, we got. Okay. All right, ran out of uh, battery. Had to switch it out. But yeah, um, it's just certainly dirty, and it needs to be cleaned up no matter what. But yeah, I'll do some research and stuff. I would not wear it as is, um, but maybe with some slight alterations, we could uh, come up with something really cool. Possible. You never know. All right. We're just going to, let me see if I can move. There we go. See if we can reach in and start pulling some of the stuff out. Oh, okay. There's a mirror in this purse. Come on, purse. Just Give us what you got. <laughs> Don't be shy now, purse. Okay, so this, by the way, is a beaded purse. It's got a mirror. That is part of it. It's got a little snap close. Um, some of the beads on it here at the end are not so great condition, but I'm kind of thinking actually of uh, making some alterations to this as well and just kind of changing it. Uh, that's what I'm thinking about doing. So, I don't know. If I do that, I'll do that on my art channel. Okay. So let's move on. It looks like there is the other earring right here, but I don't see a back to it to hold it in place. That's okay. Here's a, another pair of earrings. It looks like these are a a green. Almost, well, it's hard to see with the lighting the way that it is, but an interesting color green. Almost like, uh, 
Hmm. Slight avocado green, but it looks like a little bit more yellow than what an avocado would have. I don't know, it's, it's an interesting color. Okay, it looks like we also have here... What is this? Okay, that doesn't go away. This is a pair of bead earrings. Pretty cute. Pretty standard. Um, yeah, I don't think I have any outfits that would go well with these. So, probably not keep those ones and then we have a bracelet here it is a stretch bracelet not bad maybe one i might keep we'll see the fact that it's a stretch bracelet is a plus wow this bracelet was originally nearly 20 bucks it's crazy to me ah okay then, oh, okay, let's pull these out and show you what we got going on here. These are fun. They are for pierced ears. But yeah, look at that. I'd wear these. They're kind of funky. They're fun. They're different. Yeah. Now, these kind of things you'd usually see as a dangle, but nope. Not these puppies. Very interesting. Okay. Looks like we have another necklace here on a fairly short chain. This is just a brownish orange color drop, a jewel drop. Little topper, not bad. Like I said, for certain outfits, this could really just be that extra little pop of color needed. So, and I do have um, some earth tone outfits, so I'll keep this around for a little bit and see if I find something I can wear with it. That look nice. We have a clasp bracelet. Always been terrible about being able to open these things up correctly. There we go. Clasp bracelet. Cuff bracelet, if you will. And then trying to get them closed also is a challenge. We're just going to pretend like we got it closed, okay? That's what it looks like. Um, these are okay, but they move around a lot on um, my wrist. So these aren't ones that I normally will get or I mean, will wear just because of how much they move around. Um, on my wrist when I move so probably won't keep that one next up it looks like <laughs> a gummy bear bracelet two little gummy bears a a red gummy and a white gummy okay interesting bracelet idea so where it closes like that very interesting and then it just clasps yeah, I thought I could put it on without. Again, this is one where, you know, you got something dangling and it's probably a little big for, for me. But, yeah, just the dangle factor alone would not be uh, something I would enjoy. <laughs> so, this would be one I would also pass on. We have a little Hard Rock Cafe 1995. It looks like Christmas time. There is... The snow globe with the bow and the candy cane. So it's cute. Not one that I would wear personally, but oh, maybe somebody out there would would want it. Okay, and then it looks like we have two bracelets that are one in silver, one in gold. Very pretty. Again, though, they would do a lot of movement on my wrist, so it's not one that I would enjoy wearing. But they are very pretty. Yeah, and then we've got this last item here. I'm pretty happy with all the things. Most of the items um, that were in this lot 
are items that I really would enjoy wearing. I would say well over 50%, so I'm very pleased with my purchase. Okay, so this is just a bead necklace, lots of beads. Very pretty. Very, very pretty. Um, yeah, I could see wearing this. I keep this, I'd wear it. I'd like it. Well, thank you so much for hanging out with me. Um, hopefully you enjoyed uh, seeing what I got here. I'll put a link below to Cindy Loves Jewelry's channel. Please go show her some love and support. If you enjoyed seeing all the goodies that I um, got, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe, click that bell for notifications, and share this video. It helps my channel grow, please. Share this video and have a great day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.